okay another screencast uh, so in this video let's see how to remove all from packages in our Linux uh, all from packages are packages those are not recorded by any other applications so if you draw a dependency graph you can see those are not related to any applications those are orphans so if you uh, keep look at pacman manual page uh, you can see I think you are always uh, uh, normally aware with this Q flag, which is which will uh, query the package database and list all the packages. But what we are looking in specific is the D flag and the T flag. Now, if you come here and uh, look the D flag, which is here, the dependency flags, the querying options, you have to head to this dash Q options. And in that section, you can see dash T. In that that section, you can see the dash T flag, and from here, you can see this option can be combined with dash T in order for listing the uh, real orphan packages. Now, by removing orphan packages, I save a lot of space. Uh, like in a month, I will save uh, near uh, 500 to 600 megabytes. That's small I mean th that depends on your usage so uh, you can uh, do uh, pacman dash qdt in order for listening I right now I have two packages but you see here I have the package along with its corresponding version so I got a simple thing which will automate the process nothing but that's just a simple thing here you can see pacman dash qdt and we will awk let's uh, quickly uh, pin it okay now pacman dash qdt to print the, this uh, result and we will uh, print the first uh, here the package names only that that is what the op does now it will get rid of this version we don't need it and it will uh, remove it now if you don't know pac pacman does have a facility which will uh, take input from standard output which is, which is by uh, you know uh, this dash here which means uh, it is looking for inputs from output and uh, yeah we remove uh, those packages and, uh, and there is an alternative way this is just one line easy enough and uh, if the previous uh, this line this uh, failed um, which means if there are no uh, orphan packages it will just say nothing to clean here so just do that in one line you can do this uh, R and then uh, uh, get the output from what the QDT says but um, the problem with that is uh, it will print along with the version and we don't need it so uh, let's run these scripts and uh, the pack clean so uh, we have to type in the uh, password and right now it's asking for me to remove those let's sit and it right now and those are removed and if I run it once again there is nothing to clean here so this is just uh, an automated easy way to remove those orphan packages just to uh, when you get time that uh, will save some disk space in your system so uh, yeah, quick short video and uh, yeah, thanks for watching.